Pike says to Kirk that Starfleet needs more captains to have the instinct of leap, leaping before looking. For my dissertation, I was assigned to USS Kelvin. Some I admired about your dad. You know, that instinct to leap without looking, that was his nature too. And in my opinion, some Starfleet's lost. So he, Pike says, in my opinion, it's something that Starfleet is missing, the instinct to leap before looking. But is that good? I'm going to think if you're captain of a starship, okay. most of the time you're going to want to look before leaping. Make okay. consult with your crew, you know, look at the situation, try to logic out a response or an action. I think that's okay. the right move. However, there's probably some small percentage of the time where you don't have the time to make a decision. You don't have the time to like logic it through, get all the data, but you got to make a decision to go either that way or that way or up there, do something. And if you freeze in that moment, then you're in trouble. And so I guess Pike is saying that Starfleet is becoming too deliberate and they're not going and getting uh... things. So there are situations, say, for example, combat, where you're like, mm -hmm. if you're like, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down, mm -hmm. you may miss your opportunity to strike. And, and, and now you've lost the battle completely because you weren't fast, mm -hmm. you weren't decisive, you weren't, you weren't yeah. decisive. Right. And, so, and so Pike is saying there's not enough in that Starfleet. I see what you're saying. And so since you mm -hmm. can't train every Starfleet captain to be situationally aware, dialed in, calibrated, mm -hmm. like this is the time to strike, this is the time to pull back, you just get captains that have a, le a tendency for leap before looking. And then mm -hmm. you get other captains that deal with other scenarios that are more like, mm, let's slow it down and collaborate and get everyone's information. I see that. I guess they could also be at an institutional level. Like in the in the original series, they go on the five-year exploration mission. mission. Mm -hmm. The institution of Starfleet could have been like, should we go on an exploration mission? Should we send out probes first? We don't want to we don't want it could be unsafe we could encounter things like mm, mm. maybe we should dial it back we'll do it we'll do a three-month mission and see how it goes or you just say hey we're explorers five years let's go and we'll, we'll handle it as we go and so it's mm. a bit of a leap before looking you don't be too deliberate so like even at an institutional level there might be some problems i see and yeah i mean yeah, you said it. You said we're explorers. Exactly like in maritime time. Is that what it's called? An age sure. of exploration when we're going around sure. with boats. Some people are like, follow the coastline, map up the coastline. And we want to know where we live. Other mm -hmm. people you are like, go. Go figure out what's out there mm -hmm. come back. So you need some balance of personalities that are cautious and some balance of personalities that are like, I'm just going to go. Just going to go. Figure it out as <laughs> when we get out there. I wonder uh, which explorers just never made it back. <laughs> Probably a lot. Hey, but we're here now, right? Which means that some people that leap for looking did it right. Yeah, it's in our DNA. The look the leap, oh, the, the oh, leaping leap before looking. lookers, le the leapers before lookers. They were able to pass on their DNA to us. Therefore, we're the cool people. That's right. That's why we conquered the moon. <laughs> did we conquer it? Yeah, we did. American flag we did. right there. That's right. <laughs>